Yeah, I'll well, give you the context. He's, he's giving you his context. Yeah. Um, so we approached this gentleman asking yeah. about yes. the wife beating verse in quotation marks, yeah? Yes. So we came to him saying, yes. what does the Arabic word actually say? Oh, that's my water. Would you, would you want yeah, to watch it? We came to him asking, what does the Arabic word actually say in the verse where it's telling you how to discipline your wife? Yes. What? Yeah. No, no problem. I think a little more. Yeah. Karen, yeah. No, I want you to be ready. So, okay. So, Anisa, verse 34. Yeah? Yes. So he said, the yes. root word Daraba doesn't yes. necessarily mean strike as in physical violent strike. Yeah? Yes. I asked then, can you show me where this same word is used in a different way in the Quran? Do you is want me, me? Do you want me to explain the context of this verse, or you want? I would allow you to do that. He did it already. Okay. I would like to say, okay. say something. I'll, I'll first of all, name. first of all, Allah said, the teacher of the Quran is Prophet Muhammad. Okay. In chapter sixteen, verse forty-four, I cannot misuse the Quran or use my own opinion if I am trying to understand the Quran. I have to understand the Quran according to the teaching of Prophet Muhammad. And he taught his companions the way his companions understood. Okay, so now Quran explains one another. Quran verses explain one another, which also you believe in the Christianity. The Bible verses explain one another. I don't believe in Christian. I'm not Christian. You're not Christian. No. But he just said, I just told okay, you okay, okay, you're not okay, okay, no problem. You're not a Christian. Okay, whatever. You sure you're not a Christian? Because some of them, they, <laughs> some of them, they come here and hide their disbelief no and say, and believe their doctrine. What did I tell you? Okay, no problem. No, no, no. He didn't know. Anyway, yeah, no, I'm I didn't just know. You for, okay, no, no problem. I didn't even okay, now I'll carry. I will carry. Okay, I'll explain to you. So in the Quran, Quran verses explain one another. Also, even if a person speaks generally, his words explain one another you can't just take one word from one from a person and leave the rest so without if you do that you're not going to understand the context context is more important so prophet muhammad is the way peace be upon him in chapter 38 verse 43 allah is telling us how to be the wife also prophet in the hadith he told us do not harm them do not bruise them because even he said do not attack them the face i'll give you in sunan ibn majah hadith number 1977 sunan tirmidhi 11 62 to 63 sahil muslim hadith number 2328 he says those hadiths are saying Prophet said, the best one among you is the best one to his wife. And Prophet said, I'm the best one to his wife. Guess what? Aisha is one of the wives of Prophet. She said, Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he never, ever beaten up his wife. And who's the teacher of the Quran? Did he ever harm them? Did he ever bruise them? No. And in the Quran, it tells us the way to beat them up. It's not physical, real beat, physical one, or bruise them, harm them, because Prophet said, do not harm them. And how to beat them? Take the leaves of the branches, the leaves of the tree. Where's that written? Like, like a tooth, tooth stick. And tooth stick. Tooth stick. And yes, yeah. tooth, tooth sticks in the Quran, stick. in the Quran, not in the I've Hadith. I've showed you, I've showed you already. Chapter 38, verse 43. Yeah. Verse 43. Allah... Angel and Prophet Ayub and 38. So, so chapter 38. 38 verse 43. Let's just hold on there. Don't want to see it. So here? Yes, please read for me what it says. I want to find a specific bit, otherwise we're wasting time. Oh, just read. It says the word is uh, beat them and it says how to beat them up. Yes, read. Yes, read. Yes, read, please. Louder, please. There's nothing about that here. Just read. Thirty-eight, forty-three. Read the line. That's what I'm trying to say. Are you going to Ibn Kathir? Why would you go to? I said, go to the Quran. 
So what is this? This is Ibn Kathir. I don't want to. Uh, 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 he just went on the internet. So that's why he's confusing me. He went to Ibn Kathir. No, I'll show you. I'll show you here. Okay, take this one. Read this one. I'll open. Do you want me to show you? I know the verse of Baha, but I'll show you. No, it's not it's yeah, no problem, yeah. brother, no problem. I misunderstood you. Because I was I baffled as well when he showed me that one. <laughs> but, um, With Christian, right? Here you go, my brother. Okay. It's a 43, yeah? 43. It's the same thing I just 44. 44. 43 to 44. So it was 44. Yeah, read that's this one. No, but you went no, to I, I want you to read the context. That's why I said to you, chapter 13, verse 43, so you can go the rest now from there. Understand. So you understand that? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, brother. As long you're not harming them, you cannot harm them. Prophet said, Wadribu hunna, beat them without harming them. And how to beat, to beat them up? Take the branches of the leaves. It's like a symbolic is that kind of pain? It's, not, it's, symbolic. It's, it's just to show them yeah. that they're doing something wrong. Just like you do with a child. Yes. How do you do with a child? Do you do physical yeah, yeah, let me Now let me see the context. So that's the Take the leaves of the branches. That's clear. The, the same, yeah, but yeah, people, same, people the imagine, story. people imagine is to punch them, yeah. bruise them, yeah. harm them. If that's the case, who's the teacher of the Quran? Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, peace be upon him. Did he ever punch his wives? Did he ever bruise them? Did he ever kick them and make them feel the end? Did he did he ever harm them? In fact, he said, "Yes, misquoting." You are not man if you hit your woman. Yeah. What Prophet said when they be some guys beat beat up their wives. What Prophet said? How those guys are not the best ones of you. Exactly. Exactly. The best ones of you. Exactly. And the, so, the best among you are the best yes, to your wife. That's what Prophet And he said, What? Well, I'm the best one amongst you. Amongst you. Yes. To his wife. Subhanallah. Subhanallah. Yes. Beautiful. Word. Yes. That, every time people misquote this verse, chapter 4, verse yeah. 34. No, I think brother has 34. a misunderstanding. Yeah, it's better, I know. It's fine, it's, brother. It's you're right. right. You, understand. you ask me, brother. You know, you're you, right. You sincerely ask questions. Yeah. 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 Read, brother. This is the verse I was telling you how to beat them up. Is here. Read, brother. It says. Yeah, no, this the one, the English here. Yeah, it's the same. But it's just easier to. Oh, read word by word. Okay, read, brother, louder. I want to them to hear. Say it louder, please. Take it. Read. Shall yeah, I read it? Yeah. yeah. But who is he talking? He's talking about Job. Uh, Job, yes. He's, Allah is telling us how to beat the wives. Are you? Are, are you? Job promised to beat up his wife, and Allah said how to beat them. Do this instruction, exactly. and what did he say? Wala tahnat. You know what it means? According to the hadith, wala tahnat. Do not Word sin. Exactly. What does that mean? By harming them, them, bruising exactly. them is them. sin. Yeah, and Prophet said, what? Do not attack them, anyone, any human, from the face. Correct. Clearly mentioned. Clearly. I already, I already. I already by the way, brother Sirat. As as brother Sirat. The Quran itself is explaining. Brother Sirat. What I'm saying, like you're saying, did I get what you said before? Are the people saying what? The Hadith, the Quran, it tells us how to beat them up. Yes. I've, and the teacher of Islam is who? Just read. I want you to read. Yeah, how to yeah, discipline. Yeah, yeah. How, yeah, how to discipline. Yeah. How to discipline. Yeah. Yes. It's no yeah. actual yeah. beat. So but the word is beat, yes. but it's not actual beat. Yeah. You understand now? Because even now, I can use you beating me up. Even sometimes so what children. What is the word? Is it, is it like you said? Daraba. Daraba. So like Daraba. So Daraba the same Daraba word used beat. in Qurtaya Mum as well. Even now I can use Darab to Bab. Knocking the door is Darab to Bab. Knock the door. Darab. Darab and Darab is the same. You know, there is a root no, word. Wait, wait, wait. I'll explain to you. No, 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 no. You can't no, no. It. It's past tense. No, no. It's past tense, future tense, present tense. Yeah. Daraba. Darab al Bab. He knocked the door. Darab to Bab. Yeah. I knock the door. Darab, the word. Right. So yeah. you're reading the English because Arabic is the only word you cannot translate word by word into another language. Because Arab so is biggest, Arabic, is massive Darab. language. Yeah. Is massive language. Then, Arabic is a massive language. Allah, we don't have to go to that detail about fuel madi and mudari. Yeah, yeah, no, no. I'm just saying Darab, Darab al Bab. I already, I've given you all this understanding. Brother. If Prophet is the way and the teacher of the Quran, Aisha, do you know what she said? Aisha, Hadith Sayyid Muslim, Hadith number 23, 28. She said, the Prophet, he never beaten up a woman, a servant, 
or someone unless in the course of Allah in the battle when he's defending himself attacking the enemies and the enemies but in the battle even prophet never kill a woman never even he used to instruct us he used to instruct us even now when we go to war against the enemies we cannot kill the in and, and all the people we cannot kill women we cannot kill the children we, we cannot cut the trees, tree. trees. we cannot tree. kill the animal yeah. but the in the months, bible it says yes. kill all of them in the yeah. in the, in the, in the and samuel chapter samuel 1 samuel chapter 15 verse 3 it says go kill all of them in Islam, you only find it says the only religion says give the non Muslims peace if they incline for peace. For, for peace, yes, if they even during the war, if they ask us, they say we stop the war, you stop the war, we stop. I cannot carry on the war because Allah is commanding us to stop the war, even the battle. And before the battle, He said in chapter 60, verse 8, Allah said, What? If they are kind to you, to the non-Muslims, the non-believers, and they give you peace, give them peace. Do not attack them, do not kill them. Even if non-Muslims live in Muslim countries, we cannot attack them if they give us peace. If you kill a non-Muslim who lives by under the law of uh, under the Islamic law, Islamic country, and he's giving us peace, anyone who kills him is a sinner. You cannot kill them. In fact, in fact, if you kill without any allegation, as if you kill entire humanity, entire humanity. The only religion, the only show me in the Bible, show me in you. Yeah, I'm just saying, I'm challenging. No, that's show me in any, in anywhere, yeah, comparative. Yeah. comparative that's right, that's right. Yeah, any book which says, if during the war, if they incline for peace, give them peace. You can't find out. In chapter eight. Verse 61. Sorry, see, brother. So, you have any other question? You have? Yeah, I just want to know where is, how do we know he's talking about his wife? Is his wife because he promised in the hadith, even here, he said, What? Even here, look. Here, in the hadith, even the prophet told us why, because Quran was translated or was told us who explained to us prophet muhammad because i gave you the verse before in quran chapter 16 verse 44 prophet muhammad is the teacher of the quran and prophet muhammad وسلم, told us why this verse allah asked and when prophet job to beat up his wife because she was mocking him when he was sick he was sick for 18 years and then he promised to work her up to beat her up or to discipline her and then Allah said what? Chapter 38, verse 44. Take with your hand the leaves of the branches. And beat her, beat her up with that one. And do not sin. Why sinning? How? If you harm her, you sin. If you bruise your wife, you sin. If you kick her, you sin and you punch her. And you make you make her feel pain, you sin. Because that's what Prophet said, what in Sunan Tirmidhi I gave you before hadith number 11, 62 to 63. And in Sunan Ibn Majah I give you also hadith number 11 and 1977. Also, he says what beat them without harming them, without bruising them. If you do that, what happens? You disobey Prophet Muhammad. Yes. And in disobeying Prophet Muhammad, you disobey Allah. Because Prophet Muhammad does not speak of his own when it comes about Islam, but he speaks only what Allah inspired him. In, in Quran, chapter 53, verse 2 to 4. And also, if you disobey Prophet, what Allah said in chapter, in, in chapter 24, verse... No, 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 not that one. In chapter 60, Surah to Nur, chapter 64, I mean 24, oh, okay, okay, okay. verse 63. You know what Allah said? The second last chapter, verse of chapter 20, 24. Allah said, be careful those who oppose the command of who? Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa And his command, one of his commands is what? Do not harm your wives, but give them their rights. The only religion 
which says provide your wives, be kind to them, provision, rent, bills, all of this you, the man has to pay. Is there any religion else that can say that? No. Allah, and also, surah, what Allah, woman earns, what our wives earn, what they earn is for them, but what we earn is for them. Imagine. You can mention Imagine. also Hujjat al -Wada. Yes. You want another, another question? I was just going to ask, so yes. you're saying that to know this is about Job and his wife? And yes. I don't mind. In the hadith. I don't hide it. Yes. Because Prophet is explaining the Quran because Allah said in chapter 16, verse 44, you can search it. Allah said, We have revealed the Quran unto you, O Prophet Muhammad. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, he wants the word Daraba, another meaning of Daraba in the Quran. I can give you that one, it's easy. Okay, okay. Subhanallah. Right. Well, I've, I've given him the Quran. No, 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 no. I'll, give him, no, I'll give him the Quran yeah. verses. Okay. Darab. In the Quran, chapter 66, verse. In Surah Al Tahrim, yeah? Yes, verse. Let me see. 10 and 11. Daraballahu Makalam. Daraba. Daraba. You know the Quran by heart. Daraba. Daraba. 66, you say 10. 66, verse 10 to verse 10 and 11. Daraba. Daraballahu Makalam. Daraba. Here. Wadribuhunna Daraba. See? Daraba is here. That word is here. And another, it's also open. Wait. Yeah. Another one here. Wadaraba. Yeah, the same root word. Ah, uh, thank you. Wadraba. Daraba. What's the meaning there? What's the same? Daraba. Presence, right? Allah is an giving example. an example. 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 Oh, so it means example. Yes, yeah. it can be an example. It can be an example. I told you, Arab, do you know homophones? No, no, hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah. Brother. Does it mean example or does it mean separable? Brother, do you know... Uh, do you know what is parable? What is parable? Do you know parable? Parable. Yes. Parable is an example. Parable. We are parable. setting up an example for you. In the Bible, Jesus uses many times. In yeah, the Bible. I'm just asking. That's what Christians say, but not me. So, yeah. the first instance in uh, 34, the verse 34, where we was, we yeah. was talking about no, the chapter 4, verse 34. Yeah. 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 Striking yeah. or setting forth. Yes. No, it's not striking. It's not, not, it's not it's harming them. It's not punching them. It's not kicking them. You know, take their branches, the leaves. I always mention that it's about when you say striking them, this striking is to be understood in line with how people explain it. Just like Mother The Quran verses explain one another. Also, the hadith explain one another. Does the word mean set forth or go forth? Or does it mean it has multiple meanings? Present? It has multiple meanings. Depending if that the is the case, do you know how many times Prophet Muhammad? There's one time Prophet Muhammad left his house and he stayed without his wives. Did he ever beat them? Aisha herself said Prophet never beat up, never beaten up his wives. Yeah, we heard you say that. I'm he never beaten up a woman. Word. Just read this verse. In Sayyid Muslim Hadith Muslim. number 23, I'm 28. Asking. Does Daraba itself mean? I just give you, brother. You said, show me where Daraba has another meaning in the Quran, and I give you chapter 66, verse 10 to 11. Okay, and now I'm asking. Yes. In the context here, what does this Daraba mean? Oh, okay. I'll explain to you. In this context, means Daraba Allah. Allah is making an example. Daraba. Giving, giving, making, an giving, okay, giving, giving. So now the question is: Yes. Does daraba itself mean set forth or giving? Or that context is not giving, brother. Because, because, you know homophones. That. No, no, no. In English, do you know homophones? No. What's homophones? Tell me. Oh, you don't know. Okay, I'll explain to you. Okay. Do you know a word in English can have two different meanings, meanings. or many meanings, but depends on the context. Like now, cool. if I wait, wait, cool. wait, 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 wait. Cool. wait no, I know, brother, cool. wait, no, no. Sometimes you're cool. looking nice, yeah. but yeah. sometimes, okay. Yes. Siraj is looking cool. Yes. Does it mean Siraj is cold? Yes. Does it come from an ice fridge? No. See? Oh, another one. Okay, context. I like you, and I like, the, and you, t you talk like brother Sorry, I Nazmul. <laughs> What's the context, brother? If I say I like you, but you talk like Nazmul, is that the same context? No, it's not. And what's Thank the you. key word? Like. Yeah. Like. Yeah. Like. Masa, the, masa, key word, masa. the key word is like. Yes. So like, the word like has different meaning, meanings. 
but depends on the context. So every time, so now, okay, so now it's clear, yes? Do you have any other question? I don't know if I'll get the right answer, but sorry, I didn't understand. No, I explained to him. He say, I don't know, I don't, I have the right answer. Meaning he he's thinking he has some right answer. If no. we have the right answer, give it to us. Let me. I'll just give you question. exactly exactly. So, so previously, when we saw Daruba, what it said underneath it was to set forth slash to strike. Yeah. No, it's strike. <laughs> this is what is here, brother. It's not a strike. You know what it let says? The context. Shall I read for you the context? Let me go back. Because if you want to pretend mm -hmm. I'm stupid, that's fine. But I'm oh. asking simple questions. So brother. Minus, uh, Daraba, Allah is making. Yeah, yeah. I will make it easier. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Daraba, wait, I will make yeah. it easier. Daraba, I will explain to you. Translate word by word now, yeah? Daraba Allahu, Allah is making. Mathalan, an example. What is the example? Lilladina kafarum Brother, I just explained. I don't need. I, I give him the meaning yeah. even. So he doesn't, he's not willing to listen. He's not willing to engage. So, so uh, I, I, I give him. So why is this here and then in the other, in the other verse? Context, it's not. because that one is context. So, so I say to you, so, I like brother Nazmul, so, so, and you, you like talk like Nazmul. Pool analogy. That's okay, so if we apply the so pool analogy. So if you analogy, understand that one, so then that you have to understand this one, brother. Applied in a different context. Oh, brother, listen, because, Completely uh, different context. Wait, wait, one second, one second. This brother, I can... Brother, brother, at this. Yeah. Uh, anyways, I explained. Yeah, I don't think I need to. It's clear. Yeah, it's clear. It's clear. It's clear. What does that mean? I'm gonna go to the gym. Yeah. So that's what it is. So hitting is different. Yeah. On, on the on the, the uh, context, other, brother. The uh, context. So yeah, why is that included here? Um, oh. Same in context. If it doesn't bro. mean if it doesn't mean any physical strike, like you just said, yeah. hit the gym is not a physical strike to the gym. Why does is it, it then strike say, and beat the same? What's the difference? It's strike and beat is the same. Is it the same? Beat the drum, strike. Strike the drum. What's the difference? Is it the same? If Same, I yes. beat the drum or strike the drum, what's the Yes. Name? So how do you understand? So if you are to be the, the piano, let's say, if you are to play piano. Very simple. Yeah. Beat. That's beat. So there is a condition. When you say to uh, beat with the uh, stick. I can beat you in yeah. any way, but it depends on how my, exactly. I'm beating you up. That's yeah. what I explained so, here. Beat, and hush. Hush. And, uh, uh, yeah. Uh, what do you do with the children? Do you physically bite them? Or just tap them? Tap them so that they... Get back That's on that I've explained to you. Context, I've explained to you that. Like that. Wait, wait. I'll, I'll last, last question I'm asking. If Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, peace be upon him, said, "Do not make them. Do not harm your wives. Yeah. Yes, beat them without harming them. How can I punch her so hard, so harsh, and at the same time, I cannot make her. I cannot harm her." It would be contradictory. Yeah. yeah that's the understand now. The so, it, it doesn't make sense. Is, I want to know what's his intention. Listen. Now I just explained, brother. I'll repeat last one, brother. I'll repeat last one. I said Quran verses explain one another. Exactly. Allah exactly. told us how to beat the wives. Exactly. He said in chapter 38, verse 44, 43 to 44. He said, take the leaves of the branches. And the prophet said, what? Well, do not harm them. Do not harm them. I bruise them. If you harm them, that means if you bruise them, you harm them. It's even, even, it's mentioned as So in Surah Ibn Majah, hadith number 11. 11. I mean, 1977. Surah Ibn Then he said, yeah. You already got the whole Hadith the number 11. Multiple meaning based on the context, it's been implied. Yeah. Like my brother Siraj beautifully explained. Like beautifully explained. Beautiful no, explained cool. that, yeah. Yeah. No, Darab, Daraba. 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 It's the same. Daraba. He knocked the door. Daraba al Bab. He knocked Daraba the door. Bab. Yes. Yeah. Daraba al Bab. Means door. Bab means door. Bab means door. So when you knock the door. Yeah. Is it, is it meaning so, they were beating <laughs> the <beating laughs> so now, So now, so now, if you, if you beat your wife, right. strike. Hush. That means you're harming her, yes? And Prophet said, what? Well, do not harm her. That's why you cannot beat her up harshly. In fact, Prophet said, Otherwise, you're going to harm her. And Prophet said, do not harm her. Do not bruise her. So, her so because wife. in Sunan Tirmidhi, the hadith number, I said 11, 11, I give you 11, 62 to 63. Sunan Ibn Majah, 1977. Also in Sayyid al Muslim, I just give you 20, hadith number 23. 28. Yes. Prophet never beat, never beaten up his wife, or a woman, or a servant, yeah. 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 anyone. Exactly. So, so even here, the word Daraba, it has different meaning in the Quran. 
in chapter 66, verse 10 to 11, Daraba, Daraba Allahu Matan, Allah make set for an example. So Daraba, Daraba al Bab. You know the same way. You know the same way in Namasala Ayusa. Let's see what it is. Chapter 34 and 34, Quran is explained by another verse, also the teaching of Prophet. And Prophet Muhammad said, What is the teaching? Is the teacher of the Quran. Chapter 16, verse 44. I'm yeah. not going to repeat this. Yeah, exactly. You, if you have another question, brother, you can ask me. And I say it depends on the context. Daraba yeah, and exactly. Idrib, so Daraba. If you have any on the context. Mind, if you're I, saying, if you have, I like brother Nazmul, so or you talk right. like brother Nazmul. Two different contexts. Wait, 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 wait. If you have the prejudiced mind, that's the all explanation I give. You'll not take any explanation. You'll not take any linguistic explanation. You have the prejudiced mind. Okay, Islam is saying bidding wife, miss bidding wife. Doesn't matter what's that's the That's the out of context. They lie different. about Islam. They yeah, say, bro, they I show, they show. My my show no, my brother, my brother. Yes, my brother. do not harm yes. them. But how do you beat them up? Taking like, without like, harming them, bruising them. Okay, brother, if I take the leaves of the branches, this one now. This is what Allah said, brother. Take this in chapter 38, verse 43 to 44. Allah said, take this and be be attacked, beat her, uh, beat this with your wife, beat up this with your wife. Nephew and niece, do you know sometimes to I'm discipline them? For a simple yes, no, 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 not simple enough. It's very important for you to understand what is touching and what is beating. It's not about Quran anymore. It's about how to understand. So, 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 so when I say no so and when I say heat, is that both same? That's discipline. The verse, uh, the context of the verse. You want the inference? Yes. Is to discipline, discipline them. Exactly. The guy is, There's nowhere Prophet Muhammad attacked his wife physically, punched them, kicked them, bruised them. Nowhere you can find in the in the hadith. Even Aisha said, "What well, is one of the is one of the wives of Prophet?" What she said, he never beaten up any, any, any woman, even in his wife, even his servants. The way to protect them. Is yes. And he said, "What well, the best one is who?" The, one best the best to one wife. to his wife. And he said, I'm the best one amongst you. Why is the best one amongst us? Because he never beaten up his wife. So, Did he so bruise them? Did he punch them? Like chapter now. 4, verse 34, yeah. Yeah. explains yeah. Not the other verse of the Quran in chapter 38, verse 43 to 44. But you, you need to understand like this one. No, it's a symbolic this one does it's not harm symbolic. anyone. Not the brother, you know what? what this, you're, this, wait, needs wait. Be, this, this needs to be understood in line of how my brother said, based on the how the treatment has been applied. It doesn't say beat them the way you understand it. I just said beat. It's the same beat like. Okay, when you yes were saying no. beat like, what do you mean? How do you understand the beat like? like this like, one, the same phrase Discipline. Yeah, yeah. Discipline. So how do you understand the phrase I'm using? Uh, how do you understand this? Here. Yeah. Chapter 38, yeah. verse 43 like. to 44. That's Take the leaves of the branches no, of the trees and, 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 and beat them no, up with that one. I'll tell you what, this is the example. <laughs> beat him up. <laughs> yeah, beat him up. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Prophet said, do not harm your wives. Christians think non-Muslims, Quran says, beat up your wives. Did Prophet ever punch his wives? Never. And he said, do not harm them. Tell, tell them what the Bible says. The only religion that cares about women. No, he does, he's not a Christian. He's not Christian. I touch it. It's not my death. Brother, last Think, Severely, it will yeah. make it my more conclusion, more. my conclusion, yeah, yes. last okay. thing, the only, the only religion cares about women is Islam. Islam yes. I challenge Islam. any religion to bring here, yeah. in Islam, in Islam it says your wife, you have to provide provision, everything, rent, bills, clothing, medical, everything you have to provide her. Yeah. Whatever she earns is for her, but your money is for your That's wife, yeah. your wife and your children. No, Imagine, no, 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 no. beautiful we, religion. We, 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 and Prophet said the best one among you is the best one to his, no. the best one to his wife. In Sunan Ibn Majah, hadith number 1977, Tirmidhi, Sunan Tirmidhi, hadith number 1162 to 63. This to be an alaikum. Alright, alright, 